one particular area where uh, UNAMI has been asked uh, by the Security Council and by the government of Iraq to engage itself with is the conflict in the northern part of the country uh, between Arabs and Kurds on the exact boundaries uh, between uh, two parts of the country, the Kurdistan region and the federal state uh, of Iraq. And there um, we are talking with all parties about, first of all, the issues, so to set an agenda and to try to have everybody agree on that agenda. And then under each agenda point, trying to see what options there are. Let me give you the example of the town of Kirkuk and the province of Kirkuk. Everybody knows that that is a cause for disputes over decades. It has a very long history. Now is the time, many people feel, to try to find a status for Kirkuk that will bring peace and stability instead of ongoing, often simmering conflict. So we'll try basically to bring people, um, representatives of all sides around one table and then to um, help them step by step to come to uh, a kind of agreement that would be sustainable for the future. In the meantime, we also uh, involve ourselves with issues like the security arrangements, so how to avoid in the short run that uh, a small conflict suddenly can flare up and evolve into a very big uh, confrontation uh, because obviously uh, when people start to shoot they don't talk anymore and you won't get anywhere and for us it's just the other way around don't shoot talk and try to make a deal for the future it's good for investments it's good for social development it's good for your role as iraq in the region it's good for the world I remember uh, our role in the uh, election law, which was very difficult, um, uh, bringing parties together. As you can imagine, in the legislation, you can already start to influence something of the outcome. And of course, it's, it must be a neutral instrument for fair elections. At some point, the discussion was totally stuck. And um, we asked, actually, the different Iraqi parties whether they uh, would be uh, assisted by a UN role and only when they said yes we would like actually to see that we even would like you to suggest some options for getting out of this uh, stalemate that's what we did I invited um, in my residence representatives of all parties we had several days of discussions and in the end uh, I think it helped a lot in achieving the breakthrough an election law that was uh, uh, adopted near unanimously and I think one can say that that was a vital basis for a, a relatively fair election campaign, f uh, credible elections and a good process afterwards. So it was a very crucial role that the UN could play at that moment.